Uh, this device, uh, I expect to attain flight in the air. Through a system of leverage advantage, plus a man's physical power, I believe it's possible to fly as a bird. The human fascination with flight is eternal. Throughout the ages, man has fantasized of being airborne. Why, even in the games he plays, man has been obsessed with flight. Thrust into the sky, these projectiles have come hurtling back to Earth all too quickly, until now. Until the Frisbee disc joined man's greatest tool, his hand, with his grandest dream to fly. It's the turn of the century, and a massive wave of immigrants flood through the port of New York as America grows by leaps and bounds. On Ivy League campuses, students seek new diversions from their studies. After consuming one of their favorite snacks, pies and cookies from the nearby Frisbee Pie Company, the students toss about the empty pie tins in a moment of playful abandon. To signal the catcher of the flying tin, players exclaim, Frisbee! And a legend is born. It's the 1950s. America's in love with the automobile and the pompadour is king. The advent of plastics is changing American industry. Inventor Fred Morrison capitalizes on this new material and invents the flying disc. Morrison sells the idea to Whammo Manufacturing Company, who dubbed the product Frisbee. When you throw a ball, you really only give it a long drop. The flying disc, however, is like a little aircraft. As you throw it, you give the all-important spin. Without the spin, the disc flutters lifelessly and falls. The rotation gives both the potential for lift and stability. Of course, your throw also produces airspeed, and the air moves more rapidly over the rounded upper surface, producing a relatively lower pressure area, which results in lift. Like an airplane, the flight of the flying disc is related to its position in the airflow. If it is banked to the left, it curves left. If the leading edge or nose is up, the disc will rise and stall. Unlike a plane, however, you have to set all the controls for the disc's flight before it takes off. Once it leaves your hand, it's on its own. <laughs> 